Guess what time of year it is. <laughs> so in this video, I'm going to give you three action steps on how to finish the year strong. It's not too late. Hello, my friends of the internet. Today, reindeer, ears, and all, I have a confession to make. I've been lying to you. I've been lying to myself all year long. It actually wasn't until not that long ago that I realized that something just wasn't quite right. It wasn't sitting right in here and in here and that I needed to do something about it. The thing that was wrong was I wasn't achieving my goals the way I'd really wanted to in 2018. And don't get me wrong, I've actually had the best year of my career. I more than doubled my, my profits from last year. Um, you know, I've moved into this beautiful new apartment. I, life is grand, but still something wasn't feeling quite right. If you really want to finish this year strong, yes, there's only, what, three weeks left in the year? You're good. We've got this. So, yes, you want to finish the year strong. I want to finish the year strong. Most people do, and especially for those of us who are entrepreneurs, work for ourselves, we have certain things we want to accomplish and achieve every single year. I'm scared to say it, but it's almost been kind of a fluke. And it got me to thinking not that long ago, well, if all of these good things can happen by accident or on a fluke, imagine what can happen if I take charge and take control of a few different things in my life and in my world. So that's what I want to share with you today. Three solid action steps that you can take to finish strong. Now these are the three steps that honestly, I'm still integrating them into my life. I'm not perfect at these by any stretch of the imagination on a daily basis, but I'm making huge effort to do these things and these three things, especially every single day. Action step number one is time blocking. Oh my goodness. This has been such a game changer for me. I would show it to you on my calendar, but my calendar's on my phone and that's what I'm recording with right now. <laughs> but I literally block off my time Monday to Friday and I have a certain few things on the weekends as well. But Monday to Friday, stuff is blocked out for when I'm waking up, when I'm doing my meditation, when I'm doing my yoga, when I'm eating, when I'm showering and getting dressed, when I'm exercising, when I'm working, obviously, when I'm having lunch, I leave myself a block of time for emergencies in case every day there's an emergency. Since I've been practicing this, um, it's really been a game changer. I encourage you to start time blocking. And in fact, I'm going to create a link for you, a downloadable time block calendar. I'm going to put that in the link in the description for you. Just click on that. You don't even have to opt in. Imagine that. It's just a freebie for you. In the spirit of Christmas, action item number two is having a morning routine. Again, life altering. Oh my goodness. I meditate and I ground myself for the day. I calm my mind. I get centered and I get super crazy focused. And I tell you, it feels like there, it's just like, it's ha like having a lightning rod inside of you at all times. I could just, it, it helps you just Oh, I can't even explain it. Like it just helps you stay so focused and be so on fire for what you're doing. And honestly, if you're not happy or satisfied with what you're currently doing, I don't know. I'm not telling you what to do, but maybe 2019 is the year you need to make a change. I know I'm going to be making some changes in 2019 and there are some really cool things ahead. I can I don't have anything written in stone and nobody's made me any offers, but I've got a really good feeling, a really good feeling about 2019. Action item number three is something that you don't necessarily have to do on a daily basis, but it's something that you need to encompass on a daily basis. And that is living by your values. Now about this time last year, actually a little bit, sometime last year, <laughs> I got myself a coach 
And that was one of the main things that we discussed, my values. What are the values of myself personally? What are the values of my business? And actually, if you go to my website, making sense of social media.org, you'll see my values listed right there on the front page. That is how I run my business. And that is the heart and soul of my business. Now, my values personally are something that have even kind of evolved over the last year since I've been working with my coach. And, but solidifying those, keeping them close to your heart, memorizing them, writing them on a card and putting them in your wallet, making, you know, some sort of a poster out of them and putting them in your office. Anything you have to do to help you remember what your values are, because trust me, you're gonna get busy, you're gonna get sidetracked, you're gonna forget, uh, well, I do or did or have, so I keep those close to me at all times. I've recently rejiggered my values and came up with a list I know they say you should have like six core values. I have 12. That encompasses my big personality, <laughs> along with my really big sweater. <laughs> Living by your values. And here's another key I wanna leave for you. And this just happened to me very recently. I was struggling with making some decisions in my business. And my coach said to me, he said, Lori, if you live by your values, those challenges don't exist. And it's so true. It's like when you live by your values, when you live out those things that are so important to you, they're integral to who you are as a human being, those challenges just kind of, they melt away. They just don't even matter anymore. They don't surface up here and they definitely don't surface in here. Super exciting. So that's action item number three, live by your values. So there you have it, three action items, you know, and it, it wasn't until I stopped lying to myself and to you. And the way I was lying to you on social media was, saying I was doing all these things and writing them out in pretty posts, but yet not actually taking action on them. And again, I wanna reiterate, I'm not perfect at this stuff yet, but I am practicing daily and I am going to improve. I know that I will because I am just too tenacious not to become really, really great at these three action items. So again, time blocking, having a morning routine and living by your values. Those are three action items that are going to help you finish so strong in 2018. And you know what? If you get to the end of the year in two, three weeks from now and you haven't achieved everything that you set out to achieve, that's okay. Give yourself some slack. You've had a good year, you've done your best. You've got a brand new clean slate just ahead of you in a brand new year with 2019 and I couldn't be more excited for you. I do have something I want to offer you today. Starting on January the 2nd of 2019 is going to be when my social media marketing training program launches online. Now we're in the beta stage right now, meaning it's the best price it's ever going to be. This is a full social media marketing training, taking the last eight years of experience of what I've been doing for a living, living and breathing social media marketing for myself, for my clients. I'm packaging it all up into six modules so that you can learn social media marketing from someone who's been there, someone who's been on the front lines and can give you quality action items for you to succeed in your social media marketing in 2019. There's a lot of people out there on the internet teaching you a lot of different things, but if you know me and if you trust me, I can tell you with rock solid faith that this is going to be the best training that you can invest in for yourself and your business. If you are interested, there is a link down below to get more information. That's what I had for you today. My wonderful friends of the internet, three action items for you to finish strong. Thank you for spending a little bit of time with me today. It really does mean the world to me. You could be spending your time anywhere on this great big internet and you're here with me. I really do appreciate it. 
Until my next video, I want to wish for you a wonderful day. Bye for now. Tech real fast.